welcome to the Aria Park podcast Vlogmas 2020 Day 9. Had to think about that there. I hope you are well. It's a lot later than expected. Um, it's now quarter past six. So what we'll do is we'll jump straight in and we'll open today's advent. I'll eat that later. Might need to fight Mr. Bark for it. And oh, that's nice. I really should change my glasses. That is really nice. Thank you very much, Raylene. I can't wait to get that in. Um, so what have I been up to today? Not very much. Um, again, I'm still not feeling brilliant. Yesterday, literally, after I'd hit today, obviously in the editing suite, you click on a button and it sends it to YouTube. I had literally just hit that button when the door went and it was one of our lovely posties and there was a package. I thought we're having ordered anything. And I looked and I was like, definitely didn't order anything. I received this from Felt Fusion. It is a, the sock finger and four ply and it's the high twist. It is 80% superwash merino, 20% nylon and it's called Snow Fairy and it is love. And it is barden area here. here. It says it's not been kept anywhere near a house that can cover an area here. It's there. It is absolutely gorgeous. So I'm slightly confused. <coughs> it came with a lovely card. And I'm not going to read the full card, but it's from Jane, our uh, mouse nets and crafts. Jennifer, our daughter, Rusty, Puzzle, and Poppy Noodle the Rabbit. I. So, this is what I got. Turn it around the right way. Be all professional. I love it. So, thank you very much, guys, for my present. I love it. Um, I've not quite decided what I'm doing with it. So, watch this space because it's too nice to be a pair of socks. Plus, let's face it, I've got three cats and a dog and I don't wear anything on my feet. So, a light base, I think it would look lovely as a kill. Or a one skin show. But when I decide what I'm going to do with it, I will definitely let you know. <coughs> um... So what have I been up to today? Had great intentions this morning when I woke up that my blanket was going to get sorted. Um, I'm at the stage of my blanket where I've got one more square to put in to square it off. So, I then have to make a decision. Now, I'll show it. 
And I don't know if I said before, I've got a whole load of like bulb markers in it. And these are all to show which ones I'm needing to take pictures of. But I think you'll see. Go back a bit. It's a squint. So I'm needing to block it. Now it's a lot easier to block it block 99 squares than what it would be an entire blanket so the plan was going to be that today I was going to block it but I've been having an issue that I was needing to fix on the website so that took most of the day and most of my energy so it was, will I record earlier, then do the blanket tonight, and I was like, I can't be bothered. So, it didn't happen, but I will need to get it done tomorrow, which leaves me in a slight quandary about whether I'm going to add any more to that part. Obviously, I need to add one more square, so I'll stick this in tonight. But, and I've just unwind that again. For goodness sake. Um, I don't know whether to just keep adding to it. Um, or start another one and just do blocks in 89 squares and then just sew them together. That's actually sound like a better plan. Um, plus it will be a lot easier to carry about with me so I think that might be my plan I think I'll definitely block that and I'll get it out put it out the road um, I'll do the other one and then I need to get my mini skein list updated so what else have I been working on the heart is addictive. Let's sit here. Now the last time I measured it, and I gave me the area hairs. Um, the last time I measured it, we were at just over eight inches. Now I'm sure something tells me it's ten, ten and a half. It's to go to. So I'm just going to keep working away on that and then hopefully I should have that finished because it needs, ideally it needs to be finished for next weekend. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, uh, I think we're just going to give him his money and his, the hat and his card next weekend. So what do I have planned for the rest of the evening? Um, I'm going to stick that last square on for tomorrow. Um, think that's and then I'll probably just keep working on the hat um, so that's all for today um, plan is tomorrow my normal morning routine is obviously like up at 6 take Andrew to his work um, come back have my breakfast so it's normally about nine, half nine by the time I get myself organised. So what I shall do is tomorrow, um, I'll show you blocking out the blanket. I think that's about it. Hope you have a very crafty rest of your evening and I'll see you back here again tomorrow.